Why have Precision Door install your garage door opener as compared to some other company? Let me go through a few of the things that will make a difference to you. The most important part of the garage door is the safety eye circuit. This stops injuries from happening to yourself, your children, pets. The height of the safety eyes is very important. They should be mounted no more than six inches away from the floor. Here you can see that one of our competitors has mounted them nine inches. This is not code nor the recommendation of the manufacturer. The wall button in the garage also has a height that it must be mounted. The picture out here shows that the wire is not stapled properly, nor is the button mounted at the proper height. Wall buttons are recommended and should be mounted at five foot from the floor. This will stop little children from pushing the button and playing with the garage door as a toy. Every garage door opener is supplied with a new wall control unit. Many of our com competitors will not install these units because it takes a little bit more time. However, there are multifunctions to these wall buttons and they should be installed with every new garage door opener. The wire installation of your garage door opener is a very important part. First of all, it can be very unsightly if not wired properly or run properly. However, it can also cause a failure of your garage door opener. Here we see the wire run to the safety eye circuit pulled very tightly. This causes anything to hook in the wire to pull it from the safety eye and actually destroy the safety eyes. The proper way to run the wire is it should be stapled to the wood and given a pigtail to the safety eye. So if anything ever hooks into the wire, it has some give and doesn't pull directly out of the safety eye. This is a picture of the pigtailed wire going to the safety eye circuit. This will alleviate the wire from being pulled out from the safety eye in the event that anything gets tangled in it. The wires from your garage door motor, both from the safety eye circuit and the wall button, should be stapled neatly to the wall and not near any moving parts. This will cause entanglement with moving parts of the garage door, which will cause a failure of your garage door opener. There are a few different ways to run the wire from the front wall back to your garage door motor. In some cases, people just string them like spaghetti and hang them through the air. In other cases, they're stapled to the ceiling. Precision Door uses a garage door channel, which will conceal the wire from the front wall back to the motor alleviating any unsightly wires across your ceiling or any possibility of a wire tangling in the operating chain or belt. The wires of your garage door opener should never be run through any angle iron or through the tracks of the door. This will cause the wire to be cut by the cable or shorted out against the steel. Another important part is how your motor is secured to the ceiling. Precision door uses only one inch angle iron, not steel strapping like many other companies. Angle iron should be securely fastened to the ceiling in a beam. The pieces that come down from that should be one and a half inch or one inch angle iron, an L-shaped piece of metal, not flat strapping. Garage door openers have to be plugged into a outlet directly. Extension cords are not allowed to be used as per fire codes and fire regulations. This is the attachment point of your garage door opener to the garage door. Notice the black angle iron piece. That's called the J-bar. That extra piece of metal hanging down when the garage door is open will actually be a hazard for yourself. You'll be hitting your head on it when you're in the garage door. This piece should be trimmed so it is a actual shape of a J and not with that extra piece of angle iron hanging down. The other thing I would like to talk about is the angle iron that is actually mounted to the door. The gray angle iron, while better than what the manufacturer supplies, is not as nice as what a gosh bracket, as we call it, is onto the garage door. The gosh bracket is intended to spread the weight of the pull from the J-bar over the whole panel of the door. Having a garage door opener installed by Precision Door will ensure that you not only have a clean installation with the least amount of future problems in the wiring, but also a safe installation, which will give you many years of service.